Hello, hello guys. Welcome to my new Changing Impact video. Guys, in this video, I'm going to talk about the top 5 force charge weapon for Yoi Mia. We all know Yoi Mia is a full on-field active on-field DPS character and maximum damage Yoi Mia deals, he, she deals in elemental skill, all pyro damage by doing the normal attacks. So considering all this, the vaporized damage, the maximum time Yoi Mia does the vaporized damage including pyro and hydro all with the normal attacks so considering all this i'm gonna tell, tell you five top five four star weapons some of them are free some of them are paid and some of them you have to wish for them all of them are the best and we're gonna talk about every weapon in detail so stay tuned till the end guys all right guys let's start with the number five on number five we have king square king square is a sumeru forgeable weapon and you can for forge this weapon for free in the game as many as you want this uh, weapon having a base attack of 554 and attack percentage of 55.1 percent uh, uh yoimiya is uh, only scaled on attack percentage and some of the little elemental mastery because yoimiya does the vaporize damage all the time so if you have like uh, some 100 200 to 200 elemental mastery on yoi so it's gonna be it's gonna benefit you of course so this uh, weapon's passive ability having something related to the uh, attack percentage and the elemental mastery. After you use your elemental skill or burst, increase elemental mastery by 60 for 12 seconds. This effect will be removed when switching characters. When the teaching of forest effect ends or is removed, it will deal 100% of attack damage to near one, nearby one opponent. The teaching of the forest can be triggered once every 20 seconds so it's basically very fit with prop uh, perfectly with the ue's kit uh ue's elemental skill also stays for uh, you know 10 seconds so this weapon having a 12 second effect then uh it goes for the 18 second cd on yoimiya so you can trigger this effect every 20 seconds so it just fits perfect with the ue's kit if you have no other option and you don't want to spend your wishes on any weapon manner you can get this weapon you can get uh, this weapon on yoimiya it's not the best but it's not the worst it's a very average weapon for yoimiya it actually deals a pretty good amount of damage if you use this weapon on yoimiya because it gives a tons of tons of attack percentage and a little 6G elemental mastery sweet so guys the on number five we have the king square let's now let's talk about the number four all right guys on number four we have the black cliff warbo black cliff warbo it's a shop weapon uh, you need to spend your star leaders uh, in order to get this weapon from the shop it's a four star weapon having a base attack of 565 and a crit damage of 36.8 percent the solely purpose i am recommending this weapon just for the high base attack and the 36.8 percent crit damage we all know uh, every dps needs a crit uh, a good crit ratio and if you're having a crit uh, damage or a crit ra rate on your weapon it's it's it becomes very easy to get up amazing crit ratio on your character so uh, it is having a 36.8 percent crit damage it's a pretty good the ability is uh, it's also average not so great not so bad after de defeating an enemy attack is increased by 12 percent for 30 seconds this effect has a maximum of three stacks and the duration of each stack is independent of the other so it's good not that great or not that bad it's just average it works with you Amia, but yeah it's not that great but it's there so this weapon is on number four number on number four we having a black cliff war guys on number three guys on number three we have the very recent hundreds again not a f2p friendly weapon uh it's a battle pass weapon you need to buy battle pass and reach level 30 on battle pass in order to claim this weapon this weapon having a base attack of 510 critter of 27.6 percent i'm solely recommending this weapon again for the crit rate same i recommended black cliff for the crit damage just having a 27.6 percent crit rate 
this weapon is pretty good don't underestimate this weapon this weapon is actually very good sometimes this weapon becomes uh, more powerful compared to the rust or hamayuma or even goes close to the signature weapon of yuimi i don't know why but this weapon is pretty good the ability is uh, very unique not so good but i don't know it works or not but it's just there i don't want to read uh, the ability but the ability is not that good but this weapon is pretty pretty good like very good you can actually get a pretty uh, good crit ratio when you use this weapon this weapon is literally very good if you can buy the battle pass or if you can spend the money you can actually try this weapon on your image pretty much good so on number three we have the very recent hunt now guys uh let's talk about the number two and the number one okay before talking about the number two and number one i just uh, i just say that i'm the those twos are the my favorite weapons like the favorite weapons in the game for bows uh, favorite bows four stars bows on number two we have the hama yumi i just can't decide between number two and number one you already guessed it the number one i know but on number two uh we have the hama yumi Hama Yumi is so great weapon. This weapon is good on many characters, not only Yoimiya. And the amazing part of this weapon, it's free. It's a forgeable weapon. You can actually forge this weapon in the game. You can get this weapon to R5, no problem. It's a free, but you need to grind a little, but otherwise it's free. It's having a base attack of 554 and a substrat with a 55.1% attack. We all know attack is very important in case of Yoimi and this weapon is giving a pretty much around around 800 attack for Yoimi. 800 attack is very very good. Not 800 but 600 around 600 attack or 700 attack this weapon is giving which is very insane. Uh, in, uh, the refinement is also very good and it perfectly matches with the Yoimi as kit. Increased normal attack damage by 32% and in charge attack damage by 24% when you get this weapon to R5. When the equipping character energy reaches 100%, this effect is increased by 100%. So that means you'll get around 64% normal attack boost and turned around around 48% charge attack damage boost but charge attack damage boost is not mattered here what matters is normal attack boost you're getting 64 percent uh a normal attack damage boost which is uh, literally insane the energy part that this may have uh, ability mentioned like when this energy reaches to 100 percent so we all know that yoimiya's ultimate is literally useless the elemental bus i don't know what that uh, elemental bus does but i don't i never use that elemental bus so uh you can avoid using the elemental bus and Yoimiya's always stays on 100% energy so you will get full maximum uh, output from this refinement so on number two guys one of my favorite weapon is Hama Yumi it's just very good weapon you can craft this weapon and give it to Yoimiya you don't need to spend any money or wishes on any weapon now let's talk about the number one my personal favorite weapon Okay, on number one guys the number one the winner is a rust rust is a super cool weapon rust having a base attack of 510 41.3 percent it's the substrate the attack percentage the best thing about this is the refinement refinement on r1 i'll just say i'll just tell you r1 is having an increased normal attack damage by 40 percent but decrease charge attack damage by 10 percent only on r5 this weapon actually give you 80 percent normal attack damage increase that is literally insane like 80 percent damage increase is so good if you compare to the hama yumi hama yumi giving you the max 64 percent so it's giving you the more normal attack but you have to wish for this weapon and getting this weapon is literally very hard i don't know why when whenever i wish on the weapon manner it's literally hard to get the weapon i am having a lot of rust here but i'm playing this game from very long time and rust is uh, uh, rust is like for a two in the game for over a two year i guess now so even then i'm having only this much of the weapon so it's very sad but rust is very good weapon if you 
able to get this weapon to R5 or even R2 or R3. This weapon is super super good. It's just a perfect four shot weapon for you, Mia. You don't need to uh, run for the crit rate or crit damage in the weapon. Like you need to go for the very descent or black cliff. If you manage to get a very good ratio with the rust, I think is pretty good. I'll just show you my ratio. Uh, my Mia is currently on 70 level. I need to level up my Mia so I'll get a little crit rate here also but my crit ratio looks pretty good with the rust i need to squid tweak some uh, uh one to two artifacts here to get my uemia's crit rate to 60 percent i like my uemia having 60 percent crit rate here and 200 crit damage if i get these things with the rust it's gonna be very insane because rust is a pretty good weapon so on the number one guys rust so i just showed you the all the list on number one we having rust on number two we having hama yumi on number three we having the very decent on number three or uh, four we having a black cliff and on a number five we having the king square so these are the all list for the weapons guys i hope you like the like the list i'm having here it's just my list i love this for five weapons for your emia <laughs> guys if you have any related tension related question you can ask me in the comment and guys if you think i said something wrong in this video you can correct me in the comment no problem i hope you like the video if you do please hit the like button and subscribe my channel for more tension related videos in the future till then guys we'll meet in the next video till then Bye-bye. Take care.